Hi everybody and welcome back to Visit Feral Coast. You might remember some months ago we started doing what we called short updates which basically means that we've had some really interesting news and we wanted to share it with you without needing to physically go all the way up to Blackpool to stand on the seafront and do it. So welcome to Share Rabbit. Welcome to the other side. If you watch Brew It 2, this is the other side of my desk so you can see all the clutter and the untidiness in the background so anyway without more of ado what's the exciting news well this morning we've had a press release one of many we get lots of press releases before we come on to that don't forget make sure that you've subscribed to visit fell coast can't miss an opportunity can't miss an opportunity make sure that you hit the little bell for notifications and make sure that you've given this video a like it's just short short but perfectly formed so the big announcement well this is one that's come from visit blackpool this morning which is the official tourism organization uh, part of the council that looks after the big events and, and promoting blackpool far and wide far and wide and they've put a press release out this morning in conjunction with our friends at Coral Island. And there are going to be more fireworks this autumn. Yes, that's right, people. You can see the picture on the, on the monitor at the back of us. There are going to be more fireworks this autumn. They'd put out a press release earlier on this year and announced three firework competitions, which is slightly unusual because normally there's always been four. So I did think it seemed a little bit odd. Um, but they put out an announcement for three firework competitions and they were going to be on the 17th of September, the 1st and the 15th of October, which is alternate um, Saturday nights this autumn. And today they've revealed that, yes, drum roll and fanfare, there will be a fourth night of the display at October half term. I think the fireworks are going off. Look, they're flashing. They're flashing at the back of us. Let's give them a wiggle and then we'll brighten up. That's better. Um, <clears throat> so this is going to be a nice, spectacular finale event for the end of for the end of half term week. So the fourth display night is going to be on Friday the 28th of October. And it's thanks to a new sponsorship deal with Coral Island. And it's a fitting end to the end of the October half-term holidays, which, as you will probably know, is always by far and away the busiest week in Blackpool. It's always packed. So make sure that you've got your, your wet weather gear, you've got your coats with the hood on, and get yourself onto Blackpool Promenade so that you can enjoy the free fireworks in October half-term. So don't forget, if you want to make a stay of it, you can actually find trusted accreditation with our accommodation guide in association with Stay Blackpool. They're the Independent Hoteliers Association. So the link for that will be underneath, underneath the video in the comments. And there's loads of information about fireworks and photographs and things from previous events at visitfoutcoast.info and that's also linked underneath the video as well so don't forget all the big events as well it's not just all about the fireworks because this is blackpool after all so there's the air show on the 13th and 14th of august with the red arrows on both days at that point i felt i needed a paper airplane and i didn't have one <coughs> excuse me Ride the Lights is on 30th of August, which is our traffic-free preview of the Illuminations. And then the Illumination Switch on Concert is on the 2nd of September. So it's a busy, busy autumn. And then, of course, there's Lightpool Festival from the 14th to the 29th of October, which is also during October half term. So there you go. There you go. That's today's, that's today's short update. Build up of fireworks is from 7.30, fireworks 8.30 and all the information is on the Visit Fire Coast website, link in the comments underneath the video. So I hope you've enjoyed that little short update. Keep tuning in, make sure that you've hit that little bell 
for notifications and then you'll know when there's another one coming and don't forget to give this video a like we'll see you soon bye for now